Hi, it's Michael here from digitalhomebrew.com and I just wanted to show off some of the features of our all new digital stir plate. Uh, as you can see right off the bat that uh, it's a bit different to your usual stir plate. There's no speed dial there. Instead we have an interface with just an up and a down button for the speed and an LED for power and another one that flashes once per revolution with the speed. So we call that one the TACO. Uh, speed control is in steps of 200 RPM. As you can see that's uh, spinning around at 200 RPM, just take my word for it. <laughs> and uh, every time we press the increase speed button it just adds another 200 RPM. So we can step that all up to 2800 RPM and um, to turn it off just run it down to zero. Uh, you can also hold the button to uh, automatically speed up quickly. And you can hear that audible indication as well so that you know things are happening. And uh, that's all computer controlled inside, so it's a bit unlike any other stir plate. Uh, if I decide that 800 RPM is a good speed that keeps a, a nice um, vortex, small vortex going in my starter, then uh, next time if I want to reproduce the same starter, I know that I only have to press it two, four, six, eight, four times to get up to that 800 RPM. It's a bit of consistency between your batches. Um, it may or may not help, but it's, it's one variable you don't have to worry about. Another feature is uh, uh, little flanges on the side there you can see. So if you so desire, you can mount this to your brewing bench and um, and just keep it secure there so it never gets knocked over and uh, it could be a very helpful safety feature. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you're interested, head over to www.digitalhomebrew.com and, uh, and check them out there. Thanks.